I'm going to do it. All right. First of all, I would like to bring a few Damn, things man. to your attention. Right now, everybody trying to rap the same style with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> like, man, cut this shit off. We as pimps and players have to do more about it. And I'm taking it upon myself. I'm going to start issuing warrants on some of you suckers. I'm going to start charging you with perpetrating a fraud. We are going to issue a warrant, make you aware on national TV that you have 30 days to come in and defend yourself. And if you think by not coming that that's going to give you a break, it's not. Because we're going to do this just like they do in criminal court. We're going to adopt those same rules. If you don't respond to the 30-day notice, we're going to appoint you a lawyer, have the trial without you, find you guilty, and post your picture on the Suckers and Busters website and stamp lame on your forehead for perpetrating this fraud and lying, false flagging, and fabricating this shit that your pimps and players. These young people have gotten the information or the inclination to do what they do from these rap songs, from the lyrics. And they've gotten it from people who are not pimps, who are not players, who have made a multi-million dollar industry off the backs of those of us who really did it. But back to what I was saying, these young people hear this stuff and they think these guys know what they're talking about because they're on TV and they see them all the time and they try to do some of this bullshit that these guys claim they did and they end up either in jail or in a box in the ground. And that's the part of it that's really sad. This has got to stop. Shit, I'm ready to go. Let's squad up, y'all.